Hey, what's up everybody, this is Osama here, and in this video we're going to learn how to set up a flexible working schedule using the weekly or recurring hours or date specific hours in a Go High Level calendar. So we are in our Go High Level sub account and under settings we are under calendars and for this example I'm going to use this chiropractic adjustment calendar. So let's go ahead and click on edit here and then we're going to jump to availability tab. Now the first heading we have here is the weekly available hours. Now these are the recurring hours that define your schedule on every single week and by default it's set to Monday through Friday. So let's say we want to be available Monday through Thursday. I'm going to turn Friday off so you can easily do that here and then let's say we adjust this to 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. and then let's say if you take a lunch break you can click on this plus icon here and then you can start from 2 again. So there's a one hour gap in that and then let's say you go all the way up to 5 p.m. that would work and if you want to quickly copy the setting over you can click here and then you can copy it to all the available days here just like that and then if you want to tweak a setting for one specific day let's say on thursday you end at 4 p.m so you can easily do that here now this schedule from monday to thursday is set for every single week so every single week if somebody tries to schedule these will be the available slots but let's say you want to be flexible and you want to add specific hours on certain days maybe we have holidays coming up and you're closed or maybe you want to be available for a long weekend now how do we adjust that so that would be covered under the date specific hours here so if you click on add date specific hours this is where a calendar will pop up now as per our weekly schedule we are available on wednesday and we are open right but let's say you're taking an off on this you have a personal commitment you can click here and then if you click on this delete icon it will say unavailable here so now it will make sure that the wednesday of october 9 you are unavailable so even though we have wednesday available here this will take precedence over this because now you have input a date specific r that you will not be available here and in a similar manner if you want to add a day that is not here on the weekly schedule you can easily do that so you'll click here again and then let's say you want to be open on a saturday here for the 12th and then you can adjust the timing here so you can do eight to five or whatever you like and also do custom like we did here so let's say we want to do eight to one and then you want to do two to five and then you can click on submit and now you'll see that you will be open on the october of 12 for these specific hours and again this will take precedence over your weekly schedule on this specific day using the date specific hours you can set a very flexible working pattern and you can make sure that you're unavailable for holidays or maybe for taking off for vacation or personal commitments you can mark them here and again if you want to be available for a specific day you can include that here define the hours and make sure you have a schedule that you're fully in control of all the time that was about this tutorial if you have any questions please put them in the comments below and we'll get back to you.